Uh, thousands of uh, Connecticut seniors and the disabled are feeling the effects now of that long state budget stalemate. That annual renter's relief check that they usually get in October has not been sent, and many seniors really rely on that help. Chief political correspondent Mark Davis has been digging into this and joins us live with some answers tonight. Mark. Hi, Ann and Darren. Good evening, everyone, from the Hartford Newsroom. Yeah, if you or a friend or a parent are waiting for a renter's relief check, they are not in the mail and may not be until the end of this month. Oh, Joe Fury's on Chin Lake now. 67-year-old Linda Heston lives at Halleck's Landing Senior Housing Complex in Derby, along with about 30 other senior citizens, and most of them are still waiting for their renter's rebate checks from the state. 74-year-old Pam Eckhart, Linda's neighbor, is also in the same boat. The program is designed to help limited-income seniors and the disabled by sending a check each year based on the amount they pay for rent and utilities. The checks usually arrive mid to late October. All us elderly people count on this money that comes to us every year to either pay bills, to buy, you know, like I'm going to buy a bed with it. To pay my pending bills that have not been paid, and I'm tired of collection agencies calling me, and I was counting on it. It appears to be another problem blamed on the legislature for being so late in passing a budget. And in this case, the governor's office says this is another error in the final budget plan that needs to be fixed by lawmakers. But legislative leaders are pointing the finger back at the governor, saying they assumed the governor's budget office had already sent out the checks. Usually the governor's office sends out these checks mid-October, maybe no later than the 28th of October. And we assume those checks were written, but apparently, for whatever reason, he did not send those checks out. For whatever reason. Uh, but the good news is the $13 million that's needed to fund this program is in the new budget. It has been appropriated, so the money is there. The governor's office says there just isn't any appropriate language to accommodate the mailing out of the checks. So uh, <laughs> Senator Frisano and uh, other leaders uh, at the state capitol say that state lawmakers will be going back to Hartford either next Thursday or the Thursday after that, in any event, before Thanksgiving to straighten this out so the checks should be in the mail by the end of this month, November. Live from the Hartford Newsroom, Mark Davis, News 8.